All welcome back from Shooting News Weekly out in Central Texas at Copperhead Creek Shooting Club. And in this suede and Sherpa lined Henry pistol rug is a Henry. It's their first like not rifle. This is the Henry Big Boy Revolver. And this is the bird's head grip one. They also make a gunfighter grip, which is your kind of wider bottom more typical one. I've got a soft spot for bird's heads. And as you can see, it's polished bronze and it's blued steel. And it is an exposed ejector rod, very classic Western style revolver, double action, single action. And when I saw this year and a half, two years ago at the NRA show, when they first announced it, I immediately fell in love. I know the exposed ejector is a little controversial, I guess. I've seen people either love it or kind of not be fans. Um, I happen to be a really big fan of it. I, I think this thing looks classy and amazing. And when I felt it there, I was immediately impressed. The double action is extremely smooth. And the single action, crisp and light. There is no creep in that trigger. Fantastic, really tight. The fit, the finish, the machining, the polish on the bronze, all really, really nice. And the American Walnut looks really good too. There are also a bunch of different grip panels that you can get. There's G10 kind of modern style or this, which is Walnut with a checkering pattern if you want a little more grip. I got these, but I haven't run them. I just like the classic look of that smooth Walnut. So much ramp or groove rather on the rear black ramp front. You can swap this out and adjust it. There are different height front sights, so you can adjust your point of impact to your liking. And other than that, I mean, it runs as you would expect a typical revolver too. Um, except for being really smooth, really nice. And I also think it's priced extremely well for the quality of the gun. Um, fell in love with it. They send it for a review. I bought it. I kept it because I don't have a ton of revolvers and this one just checked like every box for me from accuracy to fit finish aesthetics and just how insanely smoothly it ran. Oops. So let's go ahead, put some 38 special down range. Then we'll switch and do a cylinder of 357 Magnum. Cause if I didn't mention, I think I forgot. It's a 38 357. It holds six rounds. Here we go. I'll shoot a couple double action, then I'll switch over. I'll shoot a couple single action. Smooth trigger. It's not big, it's not heavy, but it shoots soft. Great trigger. Nice. I, I couldn't like this gun anymore. Uh, everything about it, I, I absolutely love. It shoots amazingly well. I know with the bird's head, that curve, obviously it's better for carry, but it does have a tendency to rotate in your hand a little, especially with a smooth back strap and smooth grips. And I don't really have that problem with this Henry. Uh, it is a soft shooter, even though, again, it's not a big or heavy revolver. Um, this steel, however they made it, the brass, soaks up the recoil and it feels good. Okay, 357 Magnum. A little spicier, I can feel it, but it is very controllable and perfectly pleasant. I know Dan, who's behind the camera, is itching to shoot this thing. He has never shot it yet, so we're going to switch. Give her a shot. Wow. Nice. You're right about the bird side grip. Feels fantastic. Doesn't rotate. I guess you wouldn't expect it with 38. Let's see what 357 will do. Yeah, Dan's really our revolver guy. Obviously, he's old. <laughs> so he has a lot more experience with revolvers. Than uh, well, why does that go together? I don't understand. No, no relation. I can 
feel the difference. Yeah, the concussion from that's way more. Nice. What do you think, Henry's first revolver Love ever? Love it. They obviously took their time to make this gun a Henry. You know, it's got the quality, it's got the build, it's beautiful. Uh, the brass strapping is just looks great on it. And uh, I don't mind the exposed ejector rod at all. I think it looks kind of cool and classic. Henry did a hell of a job. It's very like Wild West. Nice. Look yeah, me. it kind of does it. look old timey with the exposed uh, ejector rod rather than having a uh, a lug. Love it. All right, y'all. That's the Henry Big Boy Revolver 38 Special 357. Gorgeous, classic, and a great shooter. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. See you on the Shooting News Weekly channel next week, tomorrow, Friday, soon.